indeed is one of the most beautiful butterflies we have. Unfortunately, at the moment, he is just covering his little blue spots, but you can see them sticking out there. They are bright, bright blue, and when the sun shines, you get this very, very pretty color that's coming out. Now, this is called a blue pansy butterfly, and this is the daddy butterfly. And the reason why he's sitting like that with his bright blue spots that are open and out and with the white on his wings is to try and attract the mommy butterfly who is around here somewhere. I saw her earlier, but she seems to have fluttered off somewhere and flown away, which means that he hasn't done a very good job. Now, if there was a predator around, you would think that this coloration would be really silly because then the predator can see this butterfly like we can out in the open with lots of bright colors. But this butterfly is very clever. If a predator arrives, it will fold its wings up. And when its wings fold up, it then is the color of the sand. So it's got like a brown coloration underneath the wing, which will match that sand. And that butterfly will then be very, very, very camouflaged. And it will be very difficult for any predator to find it. So it's a very, very clever butterfly indeed. Now, there are some other butterflies that are also flying around at the moment. But they're not as special as this one because this butterfly is one of the few butterflies that we have out here that has a territory. So pansy butterflies, they set up a little area that they will chase other males away from. And the reason why they do that is so that they don't have too much competition. Now, unfortunately, he's just flown up onto the little plant there. There we go. And you can see, look at how beautiful those blues are. And you can see as he flaps, then the color catches them and they become more blue as the wing goes down. Isn't that amazing? So it's reflecting the light, much like what we were talking about with the bird that we had early. Now look underneath the wing. Remember I was saying it's brown, almost like the sand? So you can imagine if that butterfly was sitting on the sand now, it would be really, really, really well camouflaged and would be very difficult for us to see. So it only shows its wings when it's trying to find the female who, unfortunately, like I say, flew off. But isn't that spectacular? What a beautiful, beautiful butterfly. And we don't actually see the blue pansy that much. Most of the pansies that we see here are the yellow pansy. And the way that you can tell the difference is because they've got a little yellow dot on them instead of the blue. So I'll try to see if I can find some of them because they're actually quite common here. But unfortunately, none that are with us at the moment. Now, 